And as you guys can see, my hands are completely away from the computer, but we're farming just fine. Look at all my bees, hard at work. And I am at hard at work. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you the best bee swarm script. So hopefully guys, enjoy. Once you're in the first link in the description or the second link in the description, what you guys are gonna wanna do is scroll down on the page in order to get the script. So once you see this blue get script button, you're gonna wanna click and X out. And remember you guys have to do this unless you wanna download some random program. So click again and X out for the second time. And if it downloads anything like this ISO file, just cancel or delete it. And on the third time you guys click on the button, you're gonna click on get script. It's gonna bring you here, do the tasks, click done. And that'll redirect you to right here where you guys can now copy the script. Let's inject their exploit. And remember you guys can get Yvonne in the last link in the description. Anyways, let's paste and execute the script and bam, now it's gonna show the loading screen. And now that it's done loading. Okay, come on, hurry up. Okay, now there you go. And don't leave just yet because there's plenty of features that I'll be showing you that are risky, but I'll be testing them out. Aww. Okay, so let's start off with our farming sections where you guys can select where you want to farm. So let's do sunflower field and now that we're done we can turn on auto farm bam and now it'll teleport us to the field and now we also have to turn on auto dig which it'll auto dig <laughs> and as you guys can see my hands are completely away from the computer but we're farming just fine look at all my bees hard at work and i am at hard at work i mean look at me so we can also turn on a bunch of other things like auto sprinkler, auto bubbles, auto flames, coconut shower. You guys can literally auto farm every single, oh, okay, I'm on fire. You guys can literally farm every single thing you want. Let me just turn to auto dig. I mean, we should probably keep that on. But yeah, pretty cool. I mean, why not just turn everything on? Why, why not? Why not? There you go. We're correct. And now that our honey is full, it automatically teleports us to a hive and starts to make honey. honey. But don't worry guys, there's more than just that. You guys can also auto dispenser. Uh, let's actually do that. Auto farm off, stop. We can also teleport to rare. So let's try if there's any. Uh, it doesn't look like there are, okay. Of course, auto accept and do quests. So as you guys can see, I don't have any quests from the black bear right now, but once I click E, it automatically starts a quest. And then once we're done, we just click E and it automatically finishes it. And there we go, we got the new, new quest. There you go, as you guys can see, that's what it does. And now we have a new quest down here. We can also go and fight something. It does have to be kind of close though. Hello, that's a snail. Oh, it's, oh my, look how much health he has. It's a cute little guy. Oh, okay, he hits me. We can also avoid mobs, so it'll literally like go away when auto farming, so let me show you. Yeah, it dips. But let's teleport to like the sunflower field. There you go, just like that. We can go there, we can go to the strawberry field. Okay, there's ladybugs. Okay, oh, I ran away. You guys can also teleport to a different monsters. Like we can go to ladybug bush. But you got nothing on me, ladybug. You got nothing on me. Oh, how do I hit this? Hey, can you stop? I can't defend myself. Of course, you can just teleport to a hive. And we have some miscellaneous things like walk speed, for example, super useful. And jump power, which you guys can actually change over here, so we can do like a hundred jump power. Look how that. Look at that. Look at that. We jump it. And we also have like God mode. So let, let's visit our ladybug over here. What you want to do ladybug? Exactly. You can't do nothing. And we just wrecked that ladybug. Yeah. Give me all your loot. So let me show you guys once again. All right, beetle. Come at me. As you guys can see, bam, 18, 18, 18, 18. But in reality, it does no damage because they're trash. Trash animals. W sock pot. But yeah, that's definitely useful if you guys are trying to auto farm a bunch of mobs and stuff like that. But we also have things like hide nickname if you guys... Well, now you guys don't know who I am. It's me. Yeah. So if you guys are trying to, you know, be a little more low key about your cheating, you can use that. And you have float. I know you guys have seen float before. It's pretty cool. I mean, look at that. Come on. It's like fly, basically. Yeah. Look at that. We flying. In the settings section, though, we have lots of other cool stuff. So don't don't leave just yet. So here we can change the UI color of the whole UI of itself, we can make it red. Pretty. You can also save configs. So if you guys want to save all the settings, you can save config and then load it when you launch the game back up after closing it. Over here, you guys can also grab a token by putting in the asset ID or do auto dispensers by just putting it in here. Honey storm. I think that's good. Does that give me lots of money? Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at all that. Grab that honey. Uh, I'm sure there's like an auto grab. We gotta find that. <laughs> this is kind of crazy. Um, 
Okay, I, I don't have the time, guys. I just gotta grab these. I mean, the walk speed is really useful right now. Let's be honest. I mean, look at this. Look how fast I'm walking around. Oh, no. It ended. It ended. Stop. Stop. And how about we pay our little snail friend a visit? I actually want to see if I can kill him. Because I do have god mode on, right? Hello, Mr. Snail. Oh, yeah. Okay, I don't think I can kill him. So that's kind of... Oh! Oh, I can! Miss. Okay, come on now. What? What the... He got scared. He just ran. He dipped. Also, we finished a quest with Mr. Panda over here. So, we talked to him, and just like that, we instantly accept all the text speech that nobody really reads. Comment down below right now if you guys read the lore <laughs> the bee swarm. I mean, I don't know. I to each their own, okay? I'm not I'm not I'm not going to hate on you for that. Let's actually buy some stuff. I'll just craft this. Craft this as well. Let's also max out our vacuum real quick. We gotta have that. <laughs> max out the shop. Now we need to level up. Bam. And watch this guys, watch this. I'm gonna get the best B. Best B. Oh my, that's terrible. Now I'm gonna get the best one. Best one. Oh, that, that ain't bad, that, but epic. Okay, okay, I'm not gonna complain. And before we, we get too uh, attached to our pets over here, we can also do things like the auto honey storm. I should've done that, I should've done that. I, I just, I panicked. I panicked, guys, it wasn't my fault, okay? I'm sorry. Oh, and also, we finished another quest, so let's go talk to Mother Bear over here. Hello, Mother Bear. Bam, just like that, we finished another quest. Too easy. And as we're auto-farming this field, I just noticed, why are there two snails? This is kind of scary. I feel like I'm just gonna die any second, dude. <laughs> well, I hope you guys will test out this UI because it's definitely really fun to play around with it. And I'm not the biggest Bee Swarm gamer, but it's super fun to play with. But I appreciate you for sticking along until the end. Leave a like and subscribe and then comment your favorite moment or feature from the video to join into the 19 key Synapse X giveaway I'm doing at 180K. And hopefully I'll catch you all in the next one. See you guys. Come on camera. This is all your fault. It's not that I just didn't focus you. Man.